Hey, my name is Jared Gates, and in this presentation that follows, I'm going to show you how I went from this to this without any prescription drugs, over-the-counter remedies, or painful and expensive hair transplants. I'll also show you how you can use the exact same 100% natural hair loss prevention method I did to experience a thicker, fuller, and healthier head of hair that everyone will envy. I'll even give you each step of this method right inside this presentation. Plus, in the next five minutes, you'll also discover why I believe the root cause of all male and female hair loss isn't aging, genetics, or really anything else you've ever heard of before, but a bizarre steroid your body is producing inside of you this very second. Something that's not only responsible for your hair loss, but that could be putting virtually every man with a bald spot at severe risk for prostate cancer. And that floats through your bloodstream like a lethal dose of poison, eventually reaching your hair follicles and destroying them right at the source so that they can never produce more hair again. So if you've ever felt embarrassed, frustrated, or even a little bit depressed by your bald spot, no matter how big or tiny it is, then it's vital that you stick with me for the next five minutes, because the following presentation may change your life completely. By the time you finish reading it, you will not only learn how to prevent hair loss, but you will regain the confidence that comes from once again being a complete, vital man or woman. In fact, that's exactly what happened for more than 94,992 other men and women just like you. People who use the natural and inexpensive hair loss prevention techniques inside this presentation to destroy that hair-killing steroid that's inside their bodies right now, and to have a noticeably fuller and healthier head of hair without any drugs or medications. People like Carl Landon of Admore, Alabama, Nick Kent of Salem, Massachusetts, Daniel Calderas of Flagstaff, Arizona, and Lorraine Denton of Evanston, Wyoming. Now, if you're anything like me, you're less about hype and more about cold hard facts. So let me go ahead and cut to chase by telling you exactly what this natural hair loss prevention method is, why it's been scientifically proven to work, and what makes it dramatically different than anything else you've ever seen or heard. Like I mentioned before, my name is Jared Gates. I'm 57 years old and I live just outside of St. Louis, Missouri. For me, male pattern hair loss struck early. By my mid-twenties, I had an embarrassing bald spot starting to show, which my friends love to tease me about. And by the time I'd reached my mid-thirties, that small bald spot had spread to form a shining crater across most of my head, so that the only hair I had left was a small ring of hair around the outside of my head. Perhaps the most frustrating part of this was that I wasn't a bad-looking guy, if you took away the bald spot. For example, if I wore a baseball cap when I left the house and women couldn't see my bald spot, they would flirt and smile at me and treat me like any other normal guy. But at social events or dates at nice restaurants, when I couldn't wear my ball cap, everything changed. Women would be nice to me, but they certainly didn't flirt or show any attraction. Guys who were just a few years younger than me would call me sir. The whole world seemed to react differently to me because I didn't have a full head of hair. In my 40s, things started to get really bad. That's me again in the picture you're seeing on the screen. Which is when I finally decided to start using Rogaine. I used it twice a day, every day like directed and I waited four long months, which is how long the company said it takes to work. By the end of month four, however, the results were pretty disappointing. It seemed like more hair was growing on my forehead, which was certainly not what I wanted, than on my actual bald spot. Plus, not only were the side effects starting to drive me nuts, with my scalp constantly red and rashy, and my head feeling like it was on fire, the Rogaine also cost me $40 per month to use, which meant I'd spent a full $160 before I'd even started to see a single new hair. As I did the math, I realized that worked out to $480 per year I'd need to spend on a hair treatment that was hardly even working. And as I did more research on the Rogaine website, I also found out that if you stop using Rogaine, all of the hair you've grown falls back out in 3-4 to four months. Which meant I'd need to be using their foam or gel forever and pay them about $5,000 over the coming decade, just to have a few more hairs on my head. Frustrated, I began looking at other Rogaine alternatives, things like Propecia and the generic Minoxidil but they all had the same issues for me. They were expensive, ineffective, had major side effects, and you had to use them for the rest of your life. So I said forget this and started looking into getting a hair transplant. i have been hearing ads for these on my local sports radio station and it sounded like the treatment was pretty legit. As soon as I realized what was actually involved in a hair transplant, however, I became nauseated at the thought of undergoing the surgery. I'm not sure if you realize this, but in a hair transplant, the surgeon actually slices off between 3 and 4 inches of your scalp with a knife. Then he injects hair grafts into your head, a process that is both sickeningly unnatural and extremely painful. Oh right, then there's the fact that the average hair transplant procedure costs around $9,500. 
and because it's a cosmetic procedure, your insurance usually doesn't cover it. Do you have an extra $10,000 lying around? I didn't either, so I decided to just give up on hair restoration. I figured the Rogaine simply wasn't doing enough for me to outweigh the irritation and side effects, and hair transplants were both expensive and terrifying. So I should just accept my baldness and try to ignore how ugly I felt, how little confidence I had, how much older I looked than I really was, and how the opposite sex more or less ignored me because of it. So that's where my story would have ended if something really embarrassing hadn't happened. And I'll tell you what that was right now, because as you'll see in a second, it was actually the key to the natural hair restoration method I eventually discovered. So check this out. I was at my doctor's office for my dreaded annual prostate exam. We will skip the details of that because you already know what happens during this visit and just how uncomfortable it is. But after the doctor had finished examining me, he confirmed that I had an enlarged prostate. Now, that wasn't really surprising because lately I'd found I needed to go to the bathroom more often and that I was also having trouble actually starting and stopping. See, I told you this was embarrassing. So anyways, that part wasn't shocking or anything. But what did surprise me was what my doctor said was causing my enlarged prostate. He said that a steroid called DHT is what's normally responsible for the growth of prostate cells. I'd never heard of DHT before, but my doctor said it comes from testosterone. And that as we get older, our bodies convert more and more of our testosterone into this steroid. Dr. Blount also mentioned that DHT affects women just as often as it does men, which I thought was really interesting. He said that's because ovaries produce a surprisingly large amount of testosterone. And just like with men, as women age, their bodies convert more and more of their testosterone into DHT. But regardless of whether you're a man or a woman, my doctor said the point is that high levels of DHT are not good. In men, DHT can be a major cause of prostate cancers and causes lower testosterone levels. While in women, DHT throws the body out of hormonal balance and causes mood swings, depression, and even hot flashes. Now, this was all shocking enough to me because I'd never even heard of this destructive DHT steroid before. But what my doctor said next absolutely shocked me. And it's something you should pay close attention to because it's key to why you've been losing your hair and how you can naturally prevent this process. You see, almost in passing, my doctor mentioned that as far as he knows, virtually all scientists now believe DHT to be the overwhelming cause of all hair loss. And when I asked my doctor why, he just said, well, it gets into your hair follicles and basically kills them. There's actually a ton of research coming out about this now, and if you're really interested, you can probably find some good info online. Well, I certainly was interested, and so the first thing I did was jump on my computer and begin investigating the link between DHT and hair loss. The amount of studies and research I found was pretty staggering. A Harvard University study I found confirmed the link between DHT and both male pattern hair loss and prostate cancer. A paper from researchers at George Washington University backed the Harvard study up. Another paper published in the International Journal of Women's Health also attributed DHT to female pattern hair loss. And so did additional papers from the University of Pennsylvania's Perelman School of Medicine and the Columbia University Medical Center. It made my pulse race as I thought about what this might mean. I thought to myself, if this one thing called DHT is one of the reasons for hair loss, can't I just stop it somehow and prevent my hair loss from happening too? It seemed simple enough, and so I began to spend every waking hour I could in front of my computer researching how DHT works, exactly why it causes hair loss, and how I could prevent and possibly even stop this dangerous steroid so I could not only reverse the effects of balding, but also help men to prevent painful, emasculating prostate cancer. Ultimately, this research is what would bring me to the easy-to-follow, natural, and inexpensive hair loss prevention method I'm going to share with you today, and I'll go ahead and explain everything to you right now. The first thing you need to understand is what DHT is and why it causes hair loss. DHT, also known as dihydrotestosterone, is what's called an androgen steroid hormone, and it's found inside your body. Specifically, DHT is made when your body metabolizes your testosterone. In other words, DHT is what happens when body takes normal testosterone and then turns it into this steroid hormone. Now, having a little DHT in your body is okay, but as you get older, your body begins to transform more and more of your testosterone into this steroid. Not only does that lead to lower testosterone levels and the weight loss, lower sex drive, constant fatigue and hormonal imbalance that goes along with it, and an enlarged prostate gland which can turn cancerous, it also leads to rapidly accelerating hair loss. Here's why. Usually, you grow and keep every single new hair on your head for a period of between three and six years. And once each of the hairs on your scalp reaches the end of the growth cycle, it falls out and is replaced by a new, healthier hair. 
As more and more DHT enters your bloodstream, however, this poisonous steroid begins to make its way inside the papilla, the part of your hair follicle responsible for growing new hair. The DHT then clogs up the papilla, which blocks it from growing new hairs. So when the old hairs fall out, there aren't any new hairs to replace them. Over time, that leads to balding. And it's also why your bald spot continues to grow. Because as more and more hairs are being shed without being replaced, more and more of your scalp becomes visible and your bald spot increases inside. Makes sense, right? 1. Your body produces more DHT as you get older. 2. DHT stops new hairs from growing. 3. So when the hair you have in your head falls out, there's nothing to replace it with. 4. And as a result, you go increasingly bald. And like I mentioned already, everything I've just shared with you is backed up by high-level scientific research from some of the most prestigious universities and medical associations in the world. Well, that answered some of my questions, but it led to an even larger and more important question. How do you stop your body from turning testosterone into DHT? Because what I realized was that if we could stop this process, then we could also prevent hair loss. And so I began poring over literally thousands of scientific studies, journal articles, and published research findings. It was actually pretty slow going at first because while there were dozens of studies on DHT and hair loss, there were far fewer about how to actually stop DHT from being produced in the first place. But finally, after more than two months of research, I began to notice a common culprit, something that seemed to be frequently mentioned in relation to DHT production, but that no one seemed to be targeting for a hair loss treatment. This culprit was an enzyme inside the body called 5-alpha reductase, which I like to abbreviate as 5-AR for short. As we get older, the amount of 5-AR in our bodies builds up, and what I began noticing is that all the studies I was reading said 5-AR was more or less the single cause of DHT production in your body, which meant that if I could stop my body from producing this destructive enzyme, then my body would no longer be turning my testosterone into DHT, and I'd be able to stop my balding. So the very next day, I went to work compiling all of the data and information I could find on 5-AR. I discovered that both men and women produce this enzyme. And that, as we age, the amount of 5-AR in our bodies increases dramatically until it overwhelms our bodies and begins to corrupt our testosterone production. Now that's the bad part, but here's the really good news. During my research, I also found that there were dozens of minerals, vegetables, herbs, and vitamins that had been shown to naturally inhibit the body's 5-AR production which made me think that if I were able to find the right combination of these 5-AR blocking agents, then maybe I'd be able to fight my balding, not to mention my enlarged prostate right at the source. And with that, I made myself a human guinea pig. I bought every single one of the natural minerals, vegetables, herbs, and vitamins that have been shown to stop 5-AR production, and I began testing different combinations of those items. While writing down what I was doing and how much of each supplement, vitamin, or food I was taking, for each combination, I generally allowed at least four weeks to see if I started growing any hair. And for the first several months, there was absolutely no results whatsoever. But then, halfway into the fifth month, I noticed something funny when I looked in the mirror. The bald spot on my head did look a little smaller. Here's a picture from July 19, 2012, the first time I noticed a change in my hair. And here's another picture from July 30, 2012, just two weeks after I first started noticing the first changes. What I saw was pretty encouraging. So I kept using the latest combination of natural foods, minerals, vitamins, and herbs to see what would happen. And from that point on, every day began to feel like Christmas. Each morning I would wake up, look in the mirror, rejoicing the fuller, healthier, and thicker head of hair on my scalp. Here's another pic of my transformation. This one is from August 26, 2012, and you can see how fast the changes are happening now. It was truly incredible, and the best part was just how basic and simple the combination of vitamins, minerals, veggies, and supplements I was using was. I was able to get everything in the foods and supplements I found in my grocery store, and total, they cost me about $20. And even though my total monthly cost was less than $20, the speed and fullness of my hair growth was absolutely staggering. In fact, when I visited Dr. Blount for our scheduled follow-up appointment six months later, the first thing that he asked me was if I'd gotten a hair transplant. I laughed and told him no then shared the story of how I'd been researching DHT and 5-AR obsessively since our last exam, and how I'd finally found a small group of natural vitamins, minerals, and vegetables that, when combined together, appeared to be preventing 5-AR from turning my testosterone into the dangerous DHT steroid. Well, needless to say, my doctor was absolutely amazed by all of this, especially after he gave me another prostate exam, ouch, and said he could no longer find any signs that it was enlarged. 
He then ran a blood test on me to check my testosterone levels and my DHT levels, and he was nearly speechless when the results showed that I had the testosterone of a 27-year-old, and that my body only had minimal amounts of DHT in it. This is absolutely amazing, Jared, he said. I've never seen anything like it. Would you mind writing down the combination of items you've been using and giving it to me? I'd like to share it with some of my patients. Well, of course, I was so proud of what I discovered and so excited that I immediately agreed. I wrote out all of the veggies, minerals, herbs, and vitamins I'd been using. A list of cheap supplements I'd found in my grocery store that contained those minerals and vitamins. Plus, the specific amounts of portions of each item I'd been taking in and what combinations. And emailed everything to Dr. Blout. Within a month, the stories we were hearing from Dr. Blau's patients were sharing were incredible. Men and women alike who were suffering from baldness suddenly found that they had a fuller and healthier head of hair than they had in decades. It didn't seem to matter where they were in the hair loss cycle either, or whether they just had small baby bald spots or shiny and barren scalps, or even if hair loss seemed to be genetic and run in the family. In every single case, the hair loss process was prevented. Plus, Dr. Blount's male patients all found that their prostate looked no longer enlarged, and that their testosterone levels seemed to were higher than they'd been previously. So it didn't take very long for Dr. Blount to become convinced that what I'd discovered was a medical breakthrough, something that could not only prevent all cases of pattern hair loss, but also something that may also fight off prostate cancer and restore low testosterone to healthy levels. He started talking in all of this extreme language, saying I had a moral duty to get my discovery out to the general public. And the more he badgered me about sharing my hair restoration protocol with others, the more I realized he was right. The only problem, I said, was the matter of how to actually get this natural hair growth method to the public. I'm not a businessman, I told him, and neither are you. So how do we share this baldness reversing protocol with as many people as possible? Dr. Blount's first idea was to present it to the experts at the medical school he attended. We actually had a meeting with the dean of one of the most prestigious medical research universities in the world. And during the meeting, Blount presented hundreds of case studies, along with a detailed scientific analysis of why this treatment worked. It was an incredibly impressive and thorough presentation, and you can probably imagine just how shocked we were when the dean told us that even though all of the evidence and science that our method worked was airtight, he simply could not help us to publish it, and that he was positive no other university scientist or doctor in the world would help us publish it either. I asked the dean, why the hell not? Well, what you've discovered is simply too powerful, this idiot academic said, and it does too much. Hair loss is a multi-billion per year industry, and low testosterone therapy is a multi-billion per year industry, he said. Plus, because this protocol you've created may interfere with DHT production, it may also stop virtually all causes of prostate cancer in the world. I know that sounds like a good thing, but cancer industry is about $250 billion per year in getting bigger. And as universities and medical departments all receive tens of billions of dollars in funding from drug manufacturers and pharmaceutical corporations each year, I honestly believe that if I were to support or publish this, my medical department's funding would literally be cut off overnight. It's just too big of a risk, and I can't be involved. I'm sorry. What a crock of bowl, I thought. How could someone who took an oath to help the needy and sick refuse to give something that has such amazing potential to improve their health so dramatically? I mean, yes, fuller and healthier head of hair, and the confidence that goes with it is a huge part of this one-of-a-kind protocol, especially when there are no side effects involved and results started happening at a very promising rate. But even beyond that, men who use this simple guide had finally a fighting chance to safely manage their prostate health, ultimately even preventing possibly other horrible affections. Plus, they'd even given the benefits of a low-T therapy without any of the dangerous injections or thousands of dollars that normally come along with it. So I left our meeting with the medical school dean just frothing with anger, and I decided that so rather than bowing to the bullying of some greedy pharmaceutical company, I would take a huge risk and put my hair loss prevention protocol directly on the internet, where anyone who wanted it could have access to it. I'm calling the treatment protocol the Rebuild Hair Program, and inside you'll see exactly how you can not only fight, but actually prevent your hair loss with visible results. The key to doing this is the vitamins, herbs, minerals, and foods I list out for you inside this guide. And all you have to do is combine these different natural items in the specific way I show, then add them to your diet in the right portions, which I'll also give you instructions for doing inside the guide. Your bald spot is as good as gone. In other words, all you need to do is follow the step-by-step -step protocol that's inside this guide, and you may very well delete all of the excess 5AR and DHT from your body while enjoying a full, healthy head of hair that everyone will notice. Plus, remember, the Rebuild Hair Program does more than just help you and your head of hair. 
It may also reduce your swollen prostate and might fight off prostate cancer. And it may restore your testosterone to normal, healthy levels, which in turn may allow you to enjoy the increased sex drive, energy, and fat loss that goes along with this. But men aren't the only ones who may enjoy significant added benefits from this hair restoration program. Females who use this program often report that they not only notice an immediate increase in hair health and volume, but that they also feel much more calm, centered, and happy, which happens because of the hormonal balance that occurs when DHT levels go down. To date, more than 94,900 men and women just like you have already used the Rebuild Hair program to experience a dramatically fuller head of hair in just four weeks. Check out this before and after from Jason Kepler of Long Island, New York, and Vince Delson of St. George, Utah, or this one from Nancy Gravel of Oxford, Mississippi, or Jordan Fowler of Crystal Creek, Georgia, who recently wrote to say, All I can say is, wow, when I first saw your presentation, I thought there was no way it could possibly work. I've been pretty much bald my entire life, and I've tried Rogaine, Propecia, and pretty much any other hair product you can imagine. The only reason I even gave the Rebuild Hair program a shot was because the science behind your method made so much sense, and man, am I glad I did. By the end of the very first month, I was growing new hair in my head for the first time in nearly 20 years, and by the end of the second month, there was so much hair, I could hardly even see my bald spot again. Seriously, I think everyone who suffers from hair loss should try your program immediately. So, when you stop to consider all of this, it should be pretty clear why there is nothing like the Rebuild Hair program in existence and why initially Dr. Blount and I had considered charging $369 for access to this hair restoration breakthrough. I mean, until now, men and women who wanted to fight their baldness either had to become dependent on hair loss medications like Rogaine or Propecia, which not only take four full months to start working, but also cause all kinds of unwanted side effects like hair growth on your forehead, rashes on your scalp, and even nausea. Plus, those hair restoration drugs have been designed so that you have to use them forever, or your new hair falls right back out which means that at $40 per month, you'll be spending $480 per year on Rogaine or Propecia for the rest of your life. Then again, those medications are nothing compared to a hair transplant, which typically runs you about $9,800 and involves a surgeon slowly slicing and peeling inches of your forehead off with a knife. I don't know about you, but is that something you really want to experience? Especially when every vitamin, mineral, herb, and food inside of the Rebuild Hair program costs about $20 total from your local grocery store. And when the Rebuild Hair program has been scientifically proven to be able to fight against even the worst bald spots and prevent hair loss with absolutely no side effects. So given all of that, it should be pretty easy to see why we think $369 for access to this guide is the ultimate bargain. Except here's the thing. This isn't about money for me. It's about helping as many men and women as possible to regain their confidence, their beauty, and ultimately their health. And as I thought about it and realized that not only does the DHT program give a fantastic hair loss prevention solution, but that it can also help save the lives of countless men by considerably reducing their risk of getting prostate cancer, I realized there was just no way I could live with myself if my own greed stopped people from avoiding such a deadly disease. Which is why I'm not going to ask you to pay $369 for the Rebuild Hair program or $269, or $169, because my conscience simply won't allow it. Instead, and only if you act today through this special website you're now on, you'll be able to get the entire program, the vitamin, mineral, and natural foods list, the specific instructions for how to combine those items, the daily portions guides, and everything else for the small, one-time investment of just $69. To get started, simply click the yellow button you see below right now. You'll then go to the secure checkout page that Dr. Blount and I have created, where you'll enter your basic order info. And as soon as you're finished entering that information, you'll be taken to the special members-only area that we've created for you, where you'll receive immediate access to the entire Rebuild Hair program. You'll be able to view the guides, lists, combination instructions, and everything else right from your computer, your smartphone, or your tablet. Plus, you'll also be able to download all of the materials or print out copies of everything to share with your friends and loved ones. Think about it. All that's standing between you and the confidence of a fuller, healthier head of hair, plus the prostate health, balanced hormones, and increased testosterone that goes with it, is the click of that yellow button and about 30 seconds. And on top of that, your investment today will also be covered by a comprehensive 60-day 100% money-back guarantee, which means you can try the Rebuild Hair program with zero risk and zero pressure. So simply click on the yellow button below and get started now. Then take your time viewing the list of vitamins, minerals, herbs, and foods I give you. Check out the portions guide and instructions for combining all of them. 
Then head to the grocery store whenever and spend about $20 or less picking up the few items you need. Simply follow this guide for the next month and you will be amazed when you look again in the mirror. And if you're not satisfied for any reason whatsoever or you change your mind just because, all you'll need to do is send an email to the address that Dr. Blount and I will give you inside that members only area and we'll instantly refund your entire investment with absolutely zero questions asked. Which means all you need to do right now is say maybe to the Rebuild Hair program. There's no risk at all on your end, and you have everything to gain. But we do need to warn you, if you are ready to take us up on this 100% risk-free trial, you really do need to act quickly. Because if you return in a week and find that you can no longer get your copy of this Rebuild Hair program, there simply won't be anything we can do for you. Don't take that chance, though, especially when you can have unrestricted access to the entire hair loss prevention and testosterone guide within the next 30 seconds. The choice is yours. But this presentation is finishing, and you'll need to go ahead and make your decision now. Your first option is to just let this presentation finish and then click away. That's certainly your right, and neither Dr. Blount nor I will harbor any ill feelings if that's what you do. But before you click away, take a moment to answer this question. If not the Rebuild Hair program, what will you use to restore your lost hair and eliminate your bald spot? Will you keep spending hundreds of dollars a year on Rogaine or shell out $10,000 for a cosmetic hair transplant? Or just accept the bald spot in your head and try to ignore it whenever you look into the mirror. Or blame it on genetics, or just start being that guy who always wears the baseball cap. You could choose to do any of the above, but why would you? It seems to me like the decision is pretty clear-cut here. Simply click the yellow button that you see below and get your instant risk-free access to the Rebuild Hair program right now. And you'll be amazed at your healthier head of hair like you've never been in decades. You'll sleep soundly at night knowing you've done something really good for the good health and functioning of your prostate. You'll bring your hormones into balance and find that your mood, energy, and sex drive are all significantly improved. And you'll do it all using nothing but an ingenious combination of natural vitamins, minerals, and foods that cost about $20 per month and that are sitting on the shelves in your grocery store right now. The decision is yours, but I think you know exactly what you need to do. Sincerely, Jared Gates and Dr. Blount. Hey, you still here? I bet you have some questions, right? That's totally cool. A lot of folks actually do after they read this presentation. What I found is that after I answer those most common questions, people feel a lot more comfortable making their risk-free investment in the Rebuild Hair program. So let me go ahead and clear things up for you right now, so you completely understand what you'll be getting once you start using this treatment. Number one, what makes the Rebuild Hair program different from Rogaine, Propecia, or other hair restoration drugs? Well, first of all, the Rebuild Hair program gives you a natural prevention protocol that's 100% natural. There are no weird side effects or anything like that, and totally everything you will need costs you about $20 at the grocery store. The reason something so simple like this works, while hair loss drugs don't, however, has to do with the minerals, vitamins, and foods you're given inside. Each of these items has been shown to be able to fight 5-alpha reductase, which is the enzyme that causes DHT to be made in your body. As we get older, the amount of this DHT inside you continues to increase, and eventually it fills your bloodstream and causes havoc on your body. One way that DHT causes havoc on your body is by entering your hair follicles, where it clogs them up at the root. Once that DHT is in your hair follicles, you can no longer grow new hair. So when your hair falls out, there's no new hair to replace it. That's what makes you bald. Another way DHT hurts you is by causing cell growth in your prostate. This could lead to both an enlarged prostate and even prostate cancer. Additionally, DHT lowers your testosterone levels and causes hormonal imbalances in women. So what makes the Rebuild Hair program so powerful and so different is that it may stop DHT production at the source by killing the 5-AR that's in your body. Rogaine, Propecia, or any other hair loss drug don't do anything like this whatsoever. They just take a Band-Aid approach, and they give you temporary hair growth that stops when you stop using their drugs. 2. What about a hair transplant? Wouldn't that give me hair even faster than Rebuild Hair program? Yes, it would, but there are some important facts to remember. First of all, there's the fact that hair transplants cost about $10,000 and they typically aren't covered by insurance. Second, during the procedure, the surgeon actually takes a knife and painfully slices off several inches of your scalp, then sews your head back together like a Frankenstein. Finally, this procedure doesn't actually fix the underlying cause of your hair loss. Instead, you're basically stapling already dead hairs onto your scalp and hoping they stay put. 
And in my opinion, why would you choose this option when you could naturally and permanently fix the underlying cause of your hair loss in just four weeks? 3. Okay, so what's included in the Rebuild Hair program again? Inside, you're shown exactly how to naturally prevent hair loss without any hassle. The key to doing this is the vitamins, herbs, minerals, and foods I list out for you inside this guide. And when you combine these different natural items in the specific way I show you in the program, then add them to your diet in the right portions, which I'll also give you instructions for doing inside the guide, you practically shield yourself against the dreaded hair loss process. So in other words, using this you can finally be able to delete all of the excess 5AR and DHT from your body, while enjoying a full, healthy head of hair that lasts forever. And remember, the Rebuild Hair program may also help men to reduce their swollen prostate, fight off prostate problems, and may also restore testosterone to normal healthy levels, while allowing women to balance their hormones and experience fewer mood swings and a greater sense of calm and well-being. 4. And can you just review this guarantee you mentioned for me again? How did that work? Sure, check this out. You simply say maybe to the Rebuild Hair program right now by clicking the yellow button you see below. You're then given a full two months to use this treatment protocol, so you can judge for yourself if it's as powerful as I say it is. If you're not satisfied for any reason, you just send an email to the address I give inside the guide and I'll refund your entire investment with no questions asked. 5. Okay, I want to try this out. What now? Just click the yellow button you see below. Once you do that, you'll gain instant access to the entire treatment guide and you can view all of the materials on your computer, smartphone, or tablet. On top of that, you'll also be able to download and print as many copies of this guide as you'd like.